Hey guys, Caleb's Cards here, coming at you with another baseball card binder showcase for the many, many binders and many cards I picked up from the Antique Mall. Bought a whole collection's worth in one day for well under what you'd definitely pay, I'm sure, for it off like Craigslist or anything like that, so I'd say it was worth it. This is a pretty cool binder, I think. There's some cool 90s baseball cards in here. Um, again, Every price you see in these videos is always 30% off of what you normally see. So this one's about $14 or so. Um, it's a smaller binder. Uh, I probably won't keep the binder itself. It's old and kind of gross looking. But I kind of I can use the pages and of course the cards. So let's go ahead and open this one up and just look through them real quick. Shouldn't it be a too long of a video? Got some quite a few stars here, right here on the front page. This is the EX Century uh, set from 1997. Definitely kind of ahead of its time. Um, pretty cool cards. Um, I don't have much of them, so I definitely I saw this. I, I think I literally just flipped to the first page, like, yep, put it in my my pile. <laughs> so I didn't even look beyond it. So move that up a little bit. Um, so there's some Andy Pettit, Juan Rodriguez, Ellis Burks, former Rocky, Ken Caminiti, Juan Gonzalez. So just a few from 97 and it looks like they move into either some different years or some inserts. Not entirely sure. We got Scott Rowland and Andy Pettit, star date 2000. That might still be 97, to be honest. These, we, we found a few of these in a box. So I think that box may have been leftovers of these. I don't know. But I'm down to have some duplicates. Especially if they're in better shape or something. You never know. This would have been the big card back in the day. Rick and Keel. Got Alfonso Soriano, rookie. See if there's anybody else we recognize. Hey, that's cool. Eric Gagne. This guy, uh, he uh, he's with Trevor Bauer's uh, company, and Eric Sims. He's on YouTube. You can watch him if you want. Comes uh, over to their facility in Arizona every now and then. He still looks like he can pitch, to be honest. He doesn't throw as hard as he used to, but uh, he can still. He still looks like he could pitch, to be honest. And he was pitching the batting practice to him, which was pretty fun to watch. So Eric Gagne. Um, there was also Lance Berkman on that previous page. We got a nice Mark McGuire Atomic, a Sean, a Sean Green. Uh, somebody cut out the back of the pack for the odds for some reason there. <laughs> it's kind of weird. And then saved it. There's some more from 1999. So we're going back a little bit. All out of order. <laughs> So don't have much of them, I don't think, of the 1999. This should be also 99. Okay, so it's just a different version, maybe. We got JD Drew rookie, I think, there. Or second year, maybe. I guess it's second year, technically. Got some inserts here Hyper, Travis Lee, Scott Rowland, Ben Greve, Juan Gonzalez. Those are kind of cool. I've never seen those. Empty page separating, going into Fleer Brilliance. So it transitions from upper deck to Fleer, I guess. Um, I do have some of these, I think, already, but uh, we'll take a look. I'm going to swarm through. Again, they can always be nice for future giveaways, care packages, just because packages, TTMs. You never know. You never know. And be able to add a whole bunch of Jorge Posadas to the collection eventually when we when I finally get through all these. So it's always nice. I only had a few a handful of cards of his. So a bunch of nice cards. I feel it was worth it, so definitely let me know what you think. Got a Robert Fick rookie, Russell Brannion, Gabe Kapler, Jeremy Giambi just passed away. Freddie Garcia, rookies there. Um, 
Who else? We got Chris Benson. Maybe we can classify as somebody. Doug Mankiewicz. Um, here's some uh, blue parallels. I don't have any of those currently. I used to have a whole bunch of these, so that's kind of cool. So got the blue parallels. Trot Nixon. That's not his rookie because he has rookies in '94. And we got some inserts that usually put them at the back. Richie Sexton, Eric Chavez, JD Drew, Juan Gonzalez. So, not a bad little binder for 14 bucks. So, yeah. So, hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you thought, if you thought I got a good deal on that or not. And uh, the cards look to be in good shape so far there. So, that's good. So, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Talk to you later. Bye.